Hi, in this video we're going to do a counting problem with permutations where some of the objects are identical. Let's go ahead and read the question carefully and work through it. In how many different ways can two paintings from artist A, three from artist B, and two by artist C be hung side by side on a wall? And in this problem we are also going to assume that uh, these paintings are identical. So these two paintings from artist A are basically the same painting. Uh, we're not distinguishing between the two paintings. Same thing here, the three paintings by artist B, they're basically the same painting. The only thing we care about is that they're from artist B. And likewise, uh, the two paintings by artist C are also the same painting. We're not really distinguishing uh, whether or not they're different paintings. So there is a formula. Let me show you, solution. The formula is the following. It's n factorial over, then here we have n sub 1 factorial, times n sub 2 factorial times dot 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 times n sub k factorial. And in this formula, n, factor n rather is equal to the sum. So n1 plus n sub 2 plus n sub k. And all of these uh, are different. Uh, these are the objects of the first kind, objects of the second kind, objects of the kth kind. So in our particular example, n well, we need to find out what n1 and 2 and n3 are, because we have three different artists. So we can say n1 is 2, so n1 is 2, and then n sub 2 is going to be um, 3, three, 3 by artist B, and then n sub 3 is going to be 2. So in our case, n is going to be the sum, so 2 plus 3 plus 2, which is going to be 7. So filling in the formula here, uh, we're simply going to have 7 factorial in the numerator, I'll write it over here, over, and then we have n1, which we said was 2 factorial, n sub 2, which is 3 factorial, and then n sub 3, which is 2 factorial. 7 factorial, we can work it out, 7 times 6 times 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1, and let's just write it all out, 2 factorial is 2 times 1, times 3 factorial, which is 3 times 2 times 1, and 2 factorial is 2 times 1. So this is equal to, so now we can do some simple cancellation. The 1's basically go away, so do the 2's. We don't care about the 1's here. 2 times 2 is 4, that's going to cancel with this 4, and these 3's will cancel, the 1 doesn't really matter. So we get 7 times 6 times 5. Because it's all over 1, so you get the same thing which is 42 times 5, okay, and 40 times 5 is 200, 5 times 2 is 10, so it's equal to 210 ways to hang these paintings on a wall, assuming you have two paintings from artist A, three from artist B, and two from artist C, where we only care about that the paintings come uh, from the particular artist. We don't care that the paintings are different. So again, these are identical, these are identical, these are identical. So that's how you solve a problem when you have permutations of objects where some of them are considered identical. You can use this super powerful formula. I hope this video has been helpful to you. Good luck.